Hey guys, what is up and how's it going? I hope you are having an amazing day. Today we're going to learn how you can add a sale price for your trips using WP Travel plugin. This video is going to be super important, so make sure to watch till the end. Now, WP Travel includes a sale price option using which you can provide discounted price for your trips. The sale price you have set will be visible along the cutoff regular price in the single trip page as well as in the itinerary page. Now, if somehow you don't know how to add or create a new trip, you can head over to the link in the description of this video which will help you using a step-by-step guide on how to add or create a new trip. So make sure to watch that one too. Now to add a sale price for your trips, first of all what you are going to be doing is after activation of WP Travel plugin, you will be able to see price option in the individual trip page when adding a price for category. To use this feature you need to enable the enable sale option by going to admin panel trips and all trips and from here you can select the trip of your choice on which you want to add the discounted offer or the sale price. Now here under the trip options you can see prices and dates. Now here just click on that and you will be able to see prices tab and dates tab. So under the prices tab you have the option to select pricing and make sure you are selected multiple pricing. And when you click on this add price option, you will see some fields being appeared where you can add pricing name, a min packs and a max packs. And if you scroll a little bit down, you can see a add category option. When you add a category, you have the option to add a price for that specific category. You can select any price of your choice and beneath that you can see the enable sale option. When you enable it, you can see a field being appeared where you can add a secondary price which will be appeared as a sale price for that original price. Like for example, if I select 4000 for my sale price, the original price which was 5000 will be appeared as 4000. Let's just quickly save our changes and head over to our users front page and see what so far we have done. So in our front page you can see our price of 5000 was cancelled and the new price of 4000 is being appeared on our trip homepage. So and also you can see this red little tag on the top left side of your image which highlights that this trip is currently under an ongoing offer. So pretty great right? Similarly in the itinerary page you will be able to see these red tags mentioning offer which will be highlighting that these specific trips are currently in ongoing offers which our customers could avail so that was pretty much it for this video and i hope you learned something new and if you like the video make sure to subscribe and until next time peace